You have a music theory test in five minutes? Ah, uh, all right, let's get to work. The modern keyboard. You have white keys and you have black keys and oh, they're just so beautiful. So many to choose from. Which one do we pick first? Why not middle C here? Ah, uh, yes, middle C. But where do we go from there? And why? When you move from one note to the next note up, it's called a half step. Half a step? Isn't it just like you either take a step or you don't? That's right, Johnny. When you move a half step, you move from one key to the next key, regardless of color, placement, name, timbre, tuning. It's just beautiful. It's a utopia. It's the future. Half steps are even easier to see on a guitar because all the notes look exactly the same. Wait a minute. It's also called a, a good old semitone. Semitone? That looks like 18 wheels of steel to me! Good. This is called a sharp. If you put it in front of a note, it raises it up a half step. It's new technology, Johnny. Just discovered by scientists. A flat lowers a note one half step. It's just a lowercase b. It's just a lowercase b. For example, here's an e. And that's where you play the E on the keyboard. But if somebody were to do something absolutely crazy, like add a sharp, then we wouldn't play the note here. We would go up a half step to here. But isn't that just F? F is also called E sharp. Two notes look differently on the staff, but are technically played on the same note. They're called enharmonic. 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 When the notes look different, but are technically played the same, we call it enharmonic. Harmonic. Enharmonic. Could you repeat that? I don't think I got it. Moving on. Here is a G. A G. It's a G. <laughs> What's up, G? And this is where you play the G. But if we were to do something crazy, like add a flat, we would no longer play the G here. No, 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 my good sir. We would play it a half step lower. What the heck is that voice? Which is G flat. That one right there. Whoa. Harps and flats are examples of accidentals. My teacher calls it an accident when I play the right notes. With the invention of the flat, who knows what scientists will think of next. It's a bright future, Johnny.